Well, I'm a U.S. man where I was born in a Mississippi town on a Sunday morning. Well, Mississippi just happens to occupy a place in the southeastern portion of this here United States. Well, that's a matter of fact, buddy, and you know it well. So I just call myself the U.S. man. That's M-A-L-E, son. That's me. Well, I'll say all that. I'll say all this. I've been watching the way you've been watching my miss. For the last three weeks, you've been holding the trail. You kind of upset in this U.S. man. You touch her once with your greasy hands. I'm gonna stretch your neck like a long rubber band. But she's wearing a ring. I bought her on sale. That makes her the property of this U.S. man. Better not mess with a U.S. man, my friend. U.S. man, he's mad, he's gonna do you in. You know what's good for yourself, son? You better find somebody else, son. Don't tamper with the property of a U.S. man. Tell like it is, boy. Through the rain and the heat, sleep in the snow, the U.S. mail is on his toes. So quit watching my woman, that ain't wise. You ain't pulling no war over this boy's eyes. Well, I catch you around my woman, champ. I'm gonna leave your head about the shape of a stamp. I kind of flattened out, so you do well to quit playing games with this U.S. mail. Better not mess with a U.S. man, my friend. U.S. man, he's mad, he's gonna do you in. You know what's good for yourself, son? You better find somebody else, son. Don't tamper with the property of a U.S. man. Suck it to me one more time, baby. Tell like it is, son. I'll catch you messing around that woman of mine. I'm gonna lay one on you. You're talking to the U.S. man. The American U.S. man. <laughs> 